Hello everybody, welcome back to more Elmy the Show 19 Row of the Show gameplay. I've done a little bit of uh, changes with with my uh, player off camera. Uh, maybe a little bit, just with uh, gloves and some other minor little things like that. But let's go ahead and get things started here against Colorado. You know, I'm gonna help anybody out I can. Chad Urbino, we need you. Been a little bit down lately. But even so, my batting average is through the roof. I'm hoping to keep sustaining that, just keep having these good games, multi hit games. Three and a half games behind the Reds. More than enough striking Well, distance. no rain as of yet, but threatening skies as the lights take effect. Randy Pryor getting it done. Standing in, Jamie Lynn. He too had three knocks in yesterday's win. Jamie Lynn. And he gets okay. him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Blanco can't Gotta see them all it, over. And he's got it for route number two. Now a chance to look at the starting nine for the visiting St. Louis Cardinal. So coming to the plate, Jamie Lynn. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Drilled right back up the middle. Dang it. Right to him. Ranging up the middle. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. I couldn't get under it. That was my problem. Into the box now, Jamie Lynn. And guys, seventh <laughs> inning already. Hey, I'm not complaining, but this one's been flying One -oh. by. Yeah, I'll Lynn. agree with that, Matt. That's what you get when both starting pitchers have it working. Neither of them have been nibbling around the strike zone at all, and they've trusted their defense to make the plays, and they've done just that. Yeah, and it's resulted in a game that could really go either Ooh. way in these late innings. I gotta have that. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. Keeping it down here Shit. as it's to one and two. One ball, two strikes, Something yeah. that stood out to me in this game is the lineup's lack of a solid plan at the plate. Seems like way too many guys are chasing pitches out of the zone and yeah. trying to hit pitchers' pitchers like that one down and away. There's no success in that. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone. We're tied. All oh, oh, pace is loaded. So Time for a game changer. Digging in now, Jamie Lynn. Time for a game changer right now. The bases loaded situation in a tie ball game. Behind on that one. Are you now, kidding me? A swing and a shot oh. down the corner. <laughs> mm, would have been a grand slam if he'd straightened it out. Kidding Instead, me. it's a foul ball. No. Checked his swing there. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. Ball one. That was very close. Needs a punch out here. Can he get it? Takes this Draw. the other way to right. The catch is made. Is he tagging? The they are. Run for the plate. And the runner from third the it plate. was just deep enough. Play ball. Three. Just deep enough, and that was just enough. Well, that's just a great job of battling on the road. They fought all the way to the end, took the lead in the top of the ninth, and secured the. W I didn't get the bottom any hits, end. but that sack fly was just enough. Tuesday night baseball from Denver, Colorado, and Coors Field. All right. Play ball. Stepping up now, Jamie Lynn had a great chance here for the Cardinals to add on in just the first inning. First pitch on its way, and he grooves the fastball. Oh, this is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. He's tagging. Catch made in straightaway center as the runner tags from second, and he'll make it up to third I did my job. here with one away. 
As they my job. Moving 90 feet double by Maxwell. Riding in once again, Jamie Lynn. One of the keys to securing a win. They want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Nope. That was way off on the aim now the with that. Loud contact there, but it's well fouled. I'm getting, just, I'm just mistiming these. Like I'm, like they're well hit. I'm getting the, the contact. The but... O2 pitch, swung on, Shoot. and he went fishing in the dirt. Rodriguez finds it, and the throw is there to record the first down. Leading off the inning, Jamie Lynn, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. First pitch of the at bat. And this pitch just oh, about saws him shit. off as he can't get extended at all. It's strike one. Oh, man. He just tied him up in knots right there. Grounded to third. McCormick fields it cleanly. I'm pulling the these way too start much. With a ground out, one away. That's what my problem is. Now in the box, Jamie Lynn. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. And he fouls this one off. Oh, oh shoot! And, miss, and he's quickly in the hole. Owen too. He broke out the slide step there, Danny. Yeah, he's clearly thinking. I was about not trying to right go here. down. I was Didn't actually happen, trying to go the up. Mouse game continues Such a on. habit. Scorched to third. Got the kid in there. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. I tried to go for a power swing, and that did not work. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Jamie Lynn. Should have just contact swing. That's what I should have done. First pitch on its way. Way off balance hack that time. Good for the first strike. Hey, he gets a pass right there for that ugly swing. He's been having a monster season. Take a step out of the box, regroup. He'll get right back in this AB. The 0-1 pitch. One one. And a sinker dips too low there. Into the dirt, in fact. Yeah, and if you get a guy flailing at a pitch like that, heck, you're going to go out there and throw that same pitch until he proves he can lay off of it. This is hit high in the air Dang toward it. left center. Fabregas is after it. He gets there to make the play, and that... Come on, hold it. Yes. Well, the skipper has to be pleased. They go on the road and win the first two of this series. I have not been doing series. good in this series. We need a sweep. Come on. The show comes to you. Striding in, Jamie Lynn. And as you take a look at the splits here, he's actually better against right handed pitching this season. There we go. Drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Some two out success to keep the top of the first alive. Ambush style. Oh, oh, coming. All right, they're angry. Ready now, Jamie Lynn. He singled his last time up. Yeah, guys, everyone knows he's been slumping. Dan, you can certainly attest to this. Only amassing a solid one hit in your entire career. Oh. The pressure's off now. Maybe he gets hot. Serrano, base runner at first with one out. Even with that out of the zone, I still almost hit fair. In the dirt. Oh, he's way see. out. Perfect throw, and they got him at second. Center field. Cameron Dang it. On the move. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. 
We're back now as the Rockies ready to bat in the third inning. And as they do, it's a good time to discuss their offense. Riding into the box, Jamie now Lynn. Bad. He flew out in his last at bat. Jamie. He's ready. Here's the first Lynn. offering. Owen won the count. No runs, three hits. One error for the Cardinals to this point. And boy, they're really okay. giving him fits inside now as he can't get extended there, and it's 0 2 now. That running fastball. Hit hard on the ground is short. Played on the backhand. I, I'm there. Throw not in time as he's able to leg it out. Yeah, nobody on right there, Dan. Ready once again, Jamie Lynn. Two away here in the eighth, and time's running out on him, Danny. Yeah, they don't have a lot of outs left to work with, so it's time for someone to make something happen if they're going to get Dang back it, man. into this thing. Out in front there as this one's pulled off to the left side. The 0 and 1 delivery. Hit on the ground out to short. Scooped up on the backhand. Throw Let's nine freaking go. He's in there with his third hit of the afternoon. Boy, when things are good, things are going really good. How about a swinging bunt infield single right there for his third knock of the game, Dero? Yeah, he has to be feeling frisky right now. He's had two great at bats, and then this one. Oh, that was thing. Oh, we got we got a little bit of life. Oh. Well, in hindsight, it hey, was we still got two out of three. The setup guy stay in the game and finish this thing. The fun I wasn't one. so sure. Hey, I was three for four. I had three singles. Still keeping up that batting average. Time for me to get back on track here. San Francisco. Found some alternate road. Three sixty four. See that we're already catching up. This is a winnable division. We were a few games about 500 the early Bay, on. Oracle Park on a Thursday night. Tonight, the first of this four game. Mm. Three out of four. Coming to the plate now, Jamie Lynn. And as you take a look at the splits here, he's actually better against right handed pitching this season. And a feeble okay. swing that time. It's 0 and 1. Guys, you take a look at the Giants as they begin play here tonight. They've been in a nice little groove of winning three of their last four games. Yeah, Matty, a lot of things trending Goodness in the right gracious. direction for this team. They won their last game. They scored a bunch of runs. And let's see if they continue that today. Hit sharply on the ground. Throw in time, and the side is retired. That wasn't good. All right, let's go. Just hit it deep enough. Jamie Lynn over one here in the early going. Or not. Because they're gonna intentionally walk me. And it looks as though the decision makers in the dugout will give him a free pass to first, so the bases are loaded here on the end. Let's go. Even with the ground up there, another run scored. The plate, Jamie Lynn. The left fielder, number 23. Got the treatment. Lynn. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Hit in the air out to straight Dang away. It, man. Left. Walker has a beat on it. Makes the play one away. What's the play ball? He fake! Got a stolen base in there, too. 
Ready for another chance. Jamie Lynn. He flew out in his last at bat. Almost, Matty. Almost Lynn. went deep his last A B. Certainly just missed Way it. on top. With this guy's big power. He's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this A B. Four runs, five hits. One error for the Cardinals to this point. And it's fouled away. Just staying alive. Another 0-2 coming. Pulls this one in the air out to Oh, left. if I did not over. context Two swing, that would have been gone. If I did not context swing, that would have been gone. Hi, ball. Let's go, team. In now, Jamie Select. Lynn. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A swing and a drive oh, to center field. Oh, please that be enough. A chance. Chavez is under it. Ah, uh, warning track power. Track. But he's there. And he'll get into third here on the flyout, so he's 90 feet away here with one gone. Let's go, Pryor. Oh, that was just enough. Well, that's just a great job of battling on the road. They fought all I moved that guy end, 90 feet. Took the lead in the top of the ninth. And secured the I've w still the been half. contributing That's even when I haven't been getting base hits. We are under the lights here on a Friday night at Oracle Park in San Francisco. Into the box now, That's Jamie hurt. Lynn. And as you take a look at the splits here, he's actually better against right-handed pitching this season. Trying to jam nope. him with the first pitch slider, but it's in a bit too tight for ball one. Guys, you take a look at the Giants as they begin play here tonight. They come in not exactly setting the world on fire as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. Yeah, Matty, if they're going to clean up their recent trend right now, they're going to have to find a way for it to start on the mound. They can't go out like last game and allow a bunch of runs and not play sound defense behind them. Both those things are going to have to change if this team's going to get it going in the right direction. 2-2. Two -two. And he'll yeah, try to get in the ball there, better, but he man. won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at 2-2. Two and two. Pretty standard curve in the dirt looking for a strike out there, but that was a good job of recognizing it. Oh, oh I'm glad that went foul. Oh, well, there we go. And this is going to find Triples Alley out here in right center for extra bases. Around second now and headed for third. And he is in to third with a two out triple. So just like that, there's a runner at third. They couldn't get me in, though. At the plate, Jamie Lynn. The left field, number 23. Here's the first pitch to him. Lynn. Uh, chased after that one and it's nothing in one these are huge innings for a team's morale the pitcher wants to go out and throw that shutdown inning up and get the boys back swinging the bats again with a chance to capitalize and even extend this current lead this should end the Dang inning it, as it's sent out to second throw on to first gets him and the side is retired just about set to go here as the Giants come to bat in the third inning and San Francisco fans have been fortunate all right. Stepping in, Jamie Lynn. He got on top of one. It was a ground out victim. Last Just don't time. even swing at anything unless he had a guest pitch. This guy's got burner wheels down the first base line. I don't think he even concerned himself oh, with that. Or that. He put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. Wow. He's pitching well. We're working into the middle innings right now, but this is when he's really going to have to bear down. When you start going through that lineup the second and third time, you've kind of emptied the bucket out already. So he's going to have to continue to buckle down and make good pitches. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Well, it's two and one now, and we haven't seen a fastball from him in this at bat yet. As a hitter, you've probably got to it's sit on that right now. Oh, I tried. Three and one to the Cardinals left fielder. Mm -hmm. 
takes this the other way to right. And that's drop. in for his second hit of the afternoon. Another multi-hit game for him here tonight. No surprise there. See, that one could have been either contact swing or maybe a power swing, but it's kind of doubtful. for him so far, including a triple. First offering on its way. Hit in the air out to straight away. Ah, oh, that's not Walker enough. All because I contact swing. All because of a contact swing. That would have been. I need to just keep doing my thing. Regarding that. Four nothing to score tonight. The San Francisco Giants took the lead in the second oh, inning and rode that tonight. until the very end. That should have been a no doubter. Home run. X swing would have done it. Saturday night baseball on MLB Network from 24 Willie. That's so calm. All right. Stepping in for the Cardinals, that Jamie Lynn. And as you take a look at the splits here, he's actually better against right handed pitching this season. Guys, you take a look at the Giants as they begin play here tonight. Four and two over their last six games, including a win last time out. Yeah, Maddie, this team is starting to really Let's come go. together. They won last night. They're playing really nice. I expect much more of the same today. I'm on. Sometimes you just got to trust your hands. That pitch probably wasn't even in the zone. Well, I can get away with now it. Now batting, Jamie Lynn. He reached on a single in his first try. Fouled away. Dang it. Bases are empty here with two men up. Here we go. Hit back up the ah. middle. Samuels has it. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. I hit it way too early. This team's doing very well. Stepping into the box, Jamie Lynn, a hit in two tries so far. Jamie Lynn. And here's a ball hit in the air. Dang it, man. Gaff, sprinting after it, and he makes the catch in the corner. Still getting a no hitter. Keep it up, Next pitching. For St. Louis, Jamie Lynn. He flew out in his last at bat. Keep it up, almost pitching. Maddie almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. Oh, and oh bat goodness. is quickly moving from bad to worse. It's 0-2 now. With this one almost in the books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Well, Matty V, I don't know what your thoughts are, d Roll, but boy, we... Let's go. And that gets through for a one-out base hit. Dan, count goes out the window with this batter right here. It doesn't matter if it's 0-2, 2-0. They only have two hits. Four nothing to score tonight. St. Louis jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Only had two hits. Sunday afternoon baseball on the show as we welcome you inside. 2024. Let's win the series here. Arbina's on. So striding in, Jamie Lynn. And as you take a look at the splits here, he's actually better against right-handed pitching this season. And the runner back safely. Here's the first pitch to him. Popped Dang him it, man. I couldn't get it up. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Now a chance to look at the starting nine for the visiting St. Louis Cardinals. Digging in now, Jamie Lynn, 0 for 1 here in the early going. He's ready, here's the first offering. And he gets a piece of it here, but it's chopped foul. Dang it, man. Hey, he looked like he was a little bit out in front on that breaking ball right there. 
the body can go a little bit. If he was able to keep his hands back a little bit, he might have been able to do some damage with that pitch. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone. They start the third. All right, 0 for 2. Coming to the plate now, Jamie Lynn. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part one, of what one. makes him successful. Good hard the hitting, there, though, is getting away. better. It's a ball and a strike. Yeah, and if you get a guy flailing Even the at a pitching pitch like too. That, heck, you're going to go out there and throw that same pitch till he proves he can lay off of it. Okay. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. Case in point right there, Matty. We're seeing a trend, the north and south. A lot of pitchers working that elevated fastball and then breaking stuff off in the dirt. We used to see east-west, not the case anymore. The one-two. No. Tried to hold Not up even there. close. Field down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Swung on and missed. Shoot. He didn't even come close to contact on a ball way out of the zone. One out. 3 1, 5 1 now. Okay. At the plate, Jamie Lynn. He'll look to bounce back. They're not walking me. Out his last time up. Set. Here's the nothing and nothing oh, pitch. Come on. Five ball. Not ah. particularly deep. Pendergast is there and he'll make the catch. Dang it, man. I just missed it. I just missed it. They're coming back now. Settling in now. Jamie Lynn. He flew out in his last day. I've been really streaky almost lately. Man, he almost went deep his last day. B certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard, this A.B. Comes set and the 0-1. Pitch outside the throw. Yes, sir. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. You don't see that very often against this guy. This guy has one of the best arms <laughs> in the game, but still of a successful steal of second base. And there's the fourth wide they one. So he's that. on the intentional walk. Let's play ball. Got the win though. Won the series. That is so think huge. It's just another win, but it's awfully hard to win in this game, especially on the road. But they find a way to get it done. Three out of four on the road against San Francisco. Now think about that. That's a statement series win. This manager appeals to his hitters to be more discerning at the plate. Now the Dodgers. Two games behind the Reds and Brewers. Hey, we're there. The very watered down division. Just about set for nighttime baseball from the gateway to the west. St. Very watered down. Play ball. Digging in, Jamie Lynn, and he's about as dangerous as they come. Without a doubt, he's one of the true icons in the sport today. First pitch coming, here it is. Yanked on the ground Let's go. down the line. And a sliding try there at third, but it skips by nope, nope, a nope. base hit. And a good job to get to it quickly and get it back in. That'll hold him to a two-out single. Guys, you know what we call that? We call that turn and burn. That's a bullet single down the third baseline. Third baseman's not able to make that play. Can't make that play. 
All right, there. We're down one. Digging in, Jamie Lynn. He singled his last time up. Throw over to first, and he's back easily. Trying to get one in the gap. Watch for his Ready secondary the pitches. Pitch. Here it comes. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. I These are the moments in guess the game I didn't sway it one go way down or on it. Why you get a W or a loss right here. Lead off man on, heart of the order coming up. Guy out on the mound, this guy's work cut out for him. No runs, two hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. One, two. Yank the slider across that time, laid off for a ball. Now a move over to first, and he'll be back in standing up. Here's the one and two delivery. Got him. Dang it, man. Fooled on the pitch as he swings at it in the dirt for strike And it's three. a double play. In time oh, as he just goodness. gets the tag down. That was deflating. Leading off the inning, Jamie Lynn. And Four they'll need him to get something going no here. Field. Even though we're moving Jamie. into the back end of this game, they're yeah. only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. Swing and a oh, miss, I and did he not a discipline mean here, to two. swing at that. There's another pitch for a strike, and this guy's really attacking hitters Shoot. well tonight, being aggressive early on. And if he continues to throw strikes like he is, right he's going to have a pretty good night. And that's out number one. Let's play ball. Dang he's it, man. Down. All right, last chance. Standing in, Jamie Lynn. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat. Oh, right there. The come on. Anything on no. Oh, we defenses. missed it. They could certainly roll too. And they'll quickly get it How in did he miss that? that? Third base. Grand slam, well, come on. There's a bullet base hit right there, but you have to hold there, d to make sure that gets down and isn't caught for a line drive double play. Yeah, you have to play the game right there and respect the infield and respect wow. the line drive. I know he wants to get a ribby for his buddy, but that's the way. Let's go! Gonzalez! What a freaking ninth inning comeback. Off of an error. Contest, and the man you see there was a major no, they didn't call that an error. The tops player they the call game. that a base hit. The dude just totally fielded it poorly. Wednesday night baseball. Well, you just cost your team the game. In St. Louis. <laughs> wow. Digging Ninth in, inning tonight. magic. No one no aboard for him, and two gone here in the first. Lynn. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 1. Dan D. Rowe, you check out this Dodger team as they was enter play over here tonight. They come in not exactly setting the world on no. fire as they've brought five of their last eight ball no. games. Yeah, Maddie, dropping their last game. Now they find themselves at 500 again. They got to find a way to get on a hot streak. You cannot continue to go peaks and valleys throughout the course of this season and ride that 500 line all year at some point you're going to have to take 7 out of 10, 8 out of 10 to get this going in the right direction the next 0-2 misses and that'll move it to 1-2 and two now so let's take a peek at the umpiring crew in this one, behind the plate is Matthew Ross Hey, d -Row, this is a pitcher's best friend, Matthew Ross. I'm surprised I even got there. Yeah, no excuses from the offense today. You know coming in, when you see the lineup card and Matt Ross is behind the dish, you better be aggressive. Swing, line, Stay drive. fair. That's yes. Gonna be trouble. That's a double. First, he's digging for second. Got it. And he'll no post into second here with a two-out double. Wow, he almost blew that fastball by him, but he shows some quick hands to catch up to it. And... Now to the plate, Jamie Lynn. Two, two outs. Two outs. Two outs. Him here in the third. Jamie. Now a snap Lynn. throw to first, and he'll get back in standing. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Looking to wiggle out of this. Here it is. Oh, I should have crushed that. So far this year against Southpaws, Lynn hits in the 240s, so there's room for improvement in that regard. This is the classic case of the modern day ball player right there. You Goodness. can have the batting average if your OPS is north of 800. The 02 hit the other way out toward right field. Get over his head, get over his head. Oh, it did! That's a triple. And he's in safely at third as they take the lead. Wow, with two of the it went on the barely play. over his head. A minute ago, this thing was tied up, but when you're giving up triples, you're not going to be close for too long. Now a two-run lead and a base hit away from making it three. Oh, wow, he really wasn't that close. Randy Pryor coming in. Let's go. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Jamie All right, home run or a single here. To his two RBI game from earlier. And he waves at a curveball there. No balls in a strike. But yeah, I see that a lot hey, better. He's done an amazing job of settling down. Two innings ago, I thought they were going to run him out of here. But now he's close to posting two shutout innings as a response. Fouled off. Dang it. He wants to go off speed two. first, yep. And they'll try to tempt him with a curveball, but this bounces in front of the plate, and it's one and two. Tried to get him to chase that 0-2 curveball there, but he wasn't biting. Very well could see it again here, though. Dang it. Got him. Lively fastball that time, and it puts it. It's getting close. Stepping into the box, Jamie Lynn. Two outs and two runners aboard here in the seventh Let's inning. Let's go. Oh. Fun here is this one scorched foul to the left. Come set, the 0-1. Ah, and he pulled the string a bit too sharply there on a curveball as it's down around the shoe tops. Two walks in this inning already, so he can't expect to stay out there much longer if he puts somebody else on. Wait, we'll see wait. If he can find it. From the stretch, the one two. Look out. That Freaking one almost set my face off. Two and two now. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Dang it, man. Are you freaking kidding me? So striding forward now, Jamie Lynn. He looked to bounce back. Right as I think that we're on a roll and this crap oh, yeah. happens. Yeah, kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. Right as I freaking, he was you know. On that one. And we'll see. Every time my hopes are up for something, then something like this always freaking happens. Every time. Cardinals down to their final strike here. And he fouls this one off. I mean, it's Keep every time. Young man, three foul balls in a row. He is calibrating that one, heater two. and the off speed. Let's see if he can catch something on the barrel. And he looks at a ball, one and two. You know, he's one of their guys they rely on to get their offense going. They need a rally, so we'll see if he can spark one here. Swing and Shoot. a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. 7-4 to four is the final score in tonight's game. Dennis Dent claims well, to win, win the series, the then that's our cub. MLB The Show, is it? Just win the series. That's what we got to do. Now at the plate, Jamie Lynn, that as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Jamie Lynn. First pitch on its way. And it's fouled away. Nero, Danny, this L.A. Dodger ball club as they enter play here this afternoon. They come in on the heels of a victory last time out, but they've been in a bad stretch recently, losing five. Wow. And the third baseman makes the play. That ends the end. Right to him, of course. But we're up to. 
Now at the plate, Jamie Lynn. The left fielder, number 23, Jamie Lynn. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Popped him up. Dang it. Boils has room in foul territory, and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Ready for All another right. shot now. Jamie Come Lynn, up, his Come last at bat didn't go his way Jamie. as he popped out in foul Lynn. territory. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back Just shoulder, early on and thus the result was a terrible pop up foul. This one's down to third. On to first, and there were two down. I'm blowing these opportunities. But thankfully, my team's been getting better. So digging in now, Jamie Lynn. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, I understand that, Matty. But that's just going right to these people. It's been made, and that retires the side. It's going right to these people. I about to say we do another one. I'm done. Well, just an excellent job right here, closing this one out. He just collected the first. I was about to say, if we blew another one, I was about done. Got San Diego again. Then Milwaukee, Pittsburgh, Miami. Another Pittsburgh, Miami. Now, you know what? I feel like we can get on a little bit on more of a surge here. You know, we're slowly doing better. And we're only a game and a half behind. See, if I was still with the Indians, I would have been stressing so much right now. So really, I don't even have a reason to stress out. Randy Pryor in the MVP discussion. I've been getting those arm runs and ribbies. Ah, that's out Suka, dude. It's gonna be a little bit tougher for me to get it. I'm right there in the Silver Slugger outfield discussion. Got the Brewers and Pri Pirates to be catching up on. I game behind in the wild card. Let's check how uh, the American League's going. Blue Jays right up there. Okay. The Tigers are the dominant team. And you know what? I think life's starting to look good now. Slowly but surely. <laughs> 